We apply um, tech and I think now I'm going to think about um, big data and probably advanced analytics and particularly machine and deep learning. Uh, we apply them across the R&D spectrum. So in Roche we have examples that start early in research, for example looking at images from models of tumour cells or from um, ophthalmic images where there is a huge amount of information encoded within an image that we, we would lose if we just purely looked at certain features. So using deep learning architectures, for example, we can draw a lot more information from those. Very practical examples. So as we bring a biologic towards the market, for example, an, an, an antibody treatment, uh, perhaps an onco-immunology example, we have to prove the clonality of the cell line that produces that antibody and the, the regulatory authorities demand that. And that sounds like a trivial challenge, but actually it's extremely difficult to do at scale. So again, we apply uh, automated image analysis, deep learning approaches to uh, make that process very robust. And then as we get into the clinic, I think technology is really exploding there for us. So one of the areas we've really been innovating in um, is the use of digital biomarkers. So using uh, sensors, mobiles, wearables, to have an exquisite understanding of how patients, particularly with neurodegenerative disorders, for example, Parkinson's disease uh, or multiple sclerosis, how they are, um, how their disease is progressing and how they're responding to treatment in the clinical study.